Okay, on, on this little demo, I'm gonna show you uh, what happens if you drop uh, drops of rubbing alcohol into a wash. Uh, if you uh, like to do um, scenes like with maybe some seashells or maybe even fish, and you wonder maybe how can you get those little bubbles or the little uh, maybe things swimming through the ocean that you don't really want to necessarily draw or you can't really draw in there. It's just too hard to make it look natural. Well, this is a, this is a fun way to do this. This is actually something you could um, teach your child just to kind of have fun with too, if they like fish or whatever. The, it, to start with, you put a nice big wash of ocean color. Let's just start with blue. I want this to be nice and juicy, so that's why I wet that a little bit. Actually, I'm gonna wet it a little more even. This actually works better if it's uh, a lot of, uh, if the paint's not real dry. So we'll put a lot of water and a lot of paint. You can change the color a little bit if you wanna add a little green. Uh, make, it, make it more like an ocean. Some of these uh, beautiful blues, these cold blues, really make beautiful ocean colors. Nice juicy wash. Okay. All right, uh, I have an eyedropper. And I'm, first I'm going to, uh, this is alcohol rubbing alcohol and I'm going to put just a little bit of the alcohol into the eyedropper okay and then I'm going to hold it over the paper and you can see depending on uh, how much comes out <laughs> you get a really big blob I didn't really mean to get that big of a blob let's see if we can control it just a little bit more worked at home. Here we go. Let's let it dry just a minute. Yeah, I'm not sure if we can go back in and put more paint on that, but we'll try just for, let it dry just a smidgen. Do it closer maybe. There. So that gives you these nice little, um, I don't know, is it a jellyfish? Who knows what it is? It could be, uh, um, you know, if you're into more organic stuff and you want to do a painting of different kinds of cells and things, this is a, maybe a good way to start that. You can put some alcohol into a little bottle that has sort of a little needle nose um, thing up here and just push the paint and make drops too just sort of squeeze and push, or you can actually draw with it. So you get all these nice little organic things, and if you think about it in a bigger format, um, it would be really neat if you had fish or a reef, some reef plants and so forth like that. Uh, also, you can spray it as well, and it'll give you more of a, a little spattering um, you know, maybe these little tiny fishes and uh, all the little sea creatures you see when you go snorkeling and so forth. So that's what alcohol does in a very nice juicy wash. If, you, if your paint is too dry, you may find that uh, you'll get a more subtle effect. Uh, I did this one at home, but the paint was a lot drier when I put it on there. So I still get the effect of it, but just not as much as if, you, if it's nice and juicy. Okay.